All right, man. I just did holler, boys. Um, I did not. I did not hear the word neighbor. Okay, I looked at the lyrics. The lyrics are saying neighbor. When I listen to the song, I it, it could go either way, but I I do not hear the word neighbor when I listen to it. The lyrics are telling me one thing. My ears are telling me another. So, I don't know, man. That was my first introduction to Up Church. So I'm I'm hoping you know we've got a reasonable gentleman here. Um, let's let's just get right into it, man. Let's see, because I did I did the fucking diss he did to Tom McDonald, and generally speaking, I'm over disses. I'm over disses in general. Nothing against up church. Nothing against anyone who writes disses. I just don't care. I'm sick of it. I'm about the action. Okay, if you're gonna make some you know video talking about. Whatever, man. I want to see it. Put him in a full Nelson. I don't want to hear you say it. So I want to see it. But Tom's actually a wrestler. Wrestler. I'm not. I don't care one way or the other, man. To be honest with you. But <laughs> real country, man. Let's see what we got here. Caught up in the life of a modern day cowboy Riding that Harley like I had to go still one Chasing that high danger when I wake Dodging every single bullet that's fired my way A gun and mud slinger on them county roads Southern boy tattoos from head to toe To hell with being pretty for the camera and phones I came to get dirty and I got one go To leave I don't let you my enemies Ride the storm no matter how bad Does he rap, though? I really came, honestly, I'll be honest, I came to Up Church, I wanted rap, I wanted bars, I want, like, that's, I'm a big fan of the spoken word, I'm a big fan of poetry, and you might say, oh, there's amazing poetry in this, it's like, you don't understand, like, the level of poetry that I like, and, and that I've listened to, like, I thought, you know, he had some bars in his Tom McDonald this I Somebody, I went with uh, what someone recommended, which was these two songs, and they're both singing. That's fine, man. But one thing about my channel, you won't get a bullshit reaction. I'm not gonna bullshit. Um, so I was, I was honestly open for some rap, man. But um, cause to me, it's like, man, it's kind of like it sounds like pop country to me. It sounds like pop country. He might, I don't know, maybe he really lives the lifestyle. Good for him. But the music still sounds like pop country to me. Um, you know, it's not really my cup of tea, and that's fine. You know, different strokes for different folks. But, um, <laughs> let's keep going, man. And I don't what I should do, unless you've been whiskey bent, Blair Chrysler, do. Unless you got a couple scars for a story to prove, or the souls ain't born in a pair of work boots. Yeah, I grew up away that's getting erased. Dixie Land Pride, they want to fade your face. And stick a pretty boy in to get us replaced. But you don't want to get. Shotgun and a rifle hanging in the back. Creed Fisher said it, and I'll have his back. You'll be meeting the country boys if you burn that flag. We're leaving, not respected by any means. Ride a storm, no matter. 
Are they though? Like, are they gonna meet the country boys if they burn the flag though? I don't support burning the flag, but are they gonna meet? You know, like, is are you are you real about what you're saying though? Look, I'll be honest, man. I, he just he said they're gonna replace us with a pretty boy, and then I seen him do a little twirl. I don't know, man. Don't like you're gonna get. Oh, I bet he's a Tom McDonald fan. No, nah, man. But are they gonna meet you though? Like if if they burn the flag, what you gonna kill him? Like are you are you really about what the fuck you're saying? I'm not saying you're not, but I am asking the question. It's like. I'm sorry, man. This is this, to me. It's like it's the same shit with the the gangster thug bullshit, man. People in the videos talking about the murk your whole squad. Really though, you shooting people, you killing people. You should be you. You would be in prison, right? Like you would be. In, th there's a real world, right? Like, are they gonna meet you, or are you just talking, or are you just you just selling records, man? It's the same commercial, like, I, it's it's obviously appealing to a, to a certain demographic, but I feel like this is could be some some of the same commercial bullshit, man. I don't know, man. Fisher said it and I'll have his back. You'll be meeting the country boys if you burn that flag. We're leaving, not respected by any means. Ride a storm no matter how bad it seems. Give them hell to the flames, charcoal the game. Never even try to fix my down home twice. Some nice, some nice bikes though, man. You know, just because I, I posed the question, is this some commercial bullshit? I'm not saying he is. But I am asking, is it like, is this your word? Is this your word? And, and that's, you know, do you hold to it? Or like some nice bikes though, man. Some nice bikes. Let's keep going. I know I'm gonna get some hate for this reaction, man, but well, fuck it, man. You know, I spoke my mind, dude. You know, on some real country shit, I spoke my mind. So, I mean, I, you know, <laughs> it's it's funny to me to see, like, in the background, you know, he had this, this dude that looks like he's, like, 320 pounds. It's funny to, to hear about action when you got fat motherfuckers who couldn't run a mile in a real combat zone it's like okay man all right bro